Hi YouTubers, JDCap26 here. I just do tips and repairs and with the Workforce 2750. And I'm going to show you how to do some scanning with the flatbed scanner. That's that uh, right here. You lift it up and you put the document in. Okay, right there. And uh, the top part is your ACH feed where you slip the paper in, a stack of paper, and it beeps. And you use ACH to feed and copy documents and they'll come on, go through there and come out on the flat part right over here in a stack and it'll feed them to the computer or you can print them out with copy over here so let's look at a piece of paper here here's a document and as you see it's got ridges here don't worry about that it won't bother your flatbed scanner but it may bother your ACH feed, the automatic feed with the stack. I just showed you the one on top. So it may not feed through there. When you feed these through the ACH, you have to feed them face up, I believe. And then they scan like that. But we're using just a flatbed scanner, which you lift the lid up and you put the document on there. So on the computer, we have to go and we have to open up the... Um, settings button here we're on a mac okay settings and we go to uh printer over here open that up and then there's right there where it says scan okay we're not going to open it yet so we're going to take a break here and put the document in the flatbed scanner with the print facing down so we have it in the um flatbed with the print facing down we hit scan okay and open scanner open scanner right there what it's going to do is warming up the scanner and you're going to wait for it and you hear the the bed going hear it okay now you think that scanned that document well it did it did a pre-scan but what you have to do is you got to go click on the object and you have to go like this and you have to make a box around it. This is how I t was taught how to do it. Then you have your all settings, black and white, 200, or you can go 300, 100, you can do 100. And the size is right there, it's automatically sized up. And we're gonna size it, we're gonna scan it to desktop in a JPEG. And we'll hit the button down here, scan. Scanner is warming. So now it's scanning. I'm sorry, I'm shaking here. Too much coffee. And there it is, it popped up right over here. There's your document, right there, okay? Let's open it up. And there's your document. And yeah, it's still the electric company. And all you have to do is go up here to file, go down to print, print, and make sure it's black and white and hit print and there we go we're going to start printing the document we just scanned here it is all scanned up all printed and scanned you got a duplicate and you got it on your computer and you can drop it into any folder you want you can keep that you can close it out here like that close this out this is where you open it okay and you can put this in whatever folder you want to save it say you're doing recipes and you have rest well, a bunch of recipes you want to scan just make you just make up a folder saying recipes and you drop all your recipes in there by name so that's what I want to show you today. I hope this helped you. If you have any questions, please uh, leave them below. Please rate, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more videos. And please have a great day. Thank you.